There was no way of knowing whether you were being watched at any given moment, how often or on what system the thought police watched any particular individual was guesswork. It was even conceivable they watched everybody, all the time. They'll shoot me, I don't care. They'll shoot me in the back of the head, I don't care. Down with Big Brother, they will shoot in the back of the head, I don't care. Down with Big Brother, down with Big Brother, down with Big Brother, down with Big Brother! You are the dead. It's it's about the murder of a, of a wealthy man um, on the e on the evening of his engagement party. It's not to everyone's taste. <laughs> Yes, they were, well, there was a woman who said that she enjoyed the end. She said it was very moving. She enjoyed that it ended. And she said she was happy to be moving on. I'm doing this because I need to get an electronics mark for me module. So hopefully after this, I won't have to retake it and then I'll never have to work with them again. <laughs> Some of the actors are bad. Uh, and so, well, I'm just being honest. You have to be honest in interviews. What makes the cast so special? Sandra's awful. She's awful. I do, do love being here in England. <laughs> but Hollywood is definitely um, an option for me, ideally. <laughs> Would you like to see some of my Hamlet? Is it me or is it not me? That is the question. If the audience wasn't there, the production wouldn't happen. <laughs> A lot of productions have happened, but there's been no audience at all. When you're doing theatre, you make friends. We... Yeah, it's, it's good to get to know people. <laughs> I feel fairly, fairly confident that it's all gonna go on, okay? <laughs> Name another murder mystery on the West End. I mean, can you? There's Mousetrap. Apparently it's been on for a while. In a downpour of October rain, I arrive at a neighborhood of my past. And there was Holly. Miss Holiday Go Lightly. Traveling. Enter the population of Manhattan! <laughs> Mostly, she calls me darling. I am to see you, Barajega. Well, uh, do you love him? Of course I do. Are you yourself a user of narcotics? I've had a little go at marijuana. Anything else? Anything else? Which I isn't half so destructive as brand new. What business is it of yours anyway? I'm your friend and I care. She's going from the hospital to the bank and straight to the bar. She wants you to pack her stuff. Here. If I found a real-life place that made me feel like Tiffany's, I'd buy some furniture and get the cat a name. Welcome to Monkswell Manor. I've been asked to 
come to interview the residents and the owners of this recently opened guest house. Let's see what they've got to say. Oh! It's probably one of the worst guest houses I have ever stayed in. It would look very nice in the brochure. I was looking to get away for a, a few days. Everyone here wants to know all about everyone else, but I like to keep myself to myself. I'm currently the youngest and uh, most athletic member of the police force. When I discovered it was a guest house with a charming hostess, uh, despair turns to joy. Molly has a very good head for business and uh, I'm uh, very personable. Molly has allowed me to be inspired in the kitchen. <laughs> She's letting me concoct all sorts of things from her larder. Well, there you have it. Monkswell Manor. Splendid. <laughs>